I made it. All right, gotta levitate this rock. Here's that dang rock. I am Tiny the Barbarian. I am the strongest creature alive. Nobody lifts my rock but me! You know, it's ironic that your name is Tiny because you're actually very large. Yes, Tiny likes irony. Do you want to ti do you want tiny to show you the real way to lift a rock? No. I'll do it for a tapestry from the market. Sure, go ahead. It's a deal. Clear the way. This is going to be good. Is he gonna hurt his back? No. Now, that's how you lift a rock. I wonder if that rock will ever land. Yay. Wait, what? Oh, the rock. Is it going to do something here? Uh. <laughs> well, that landed perfectly. Well, it sure took a long time for that rock to fall. He threw it west and it went south, though. Call bead. 200 jewels. Heal up, because that guy can kill in one hit with HP now. Now you can de-equip that levitate thing, you'll never use it again. You're gonna need to switch to your dog. Huh, okay. So let's go over here, because this is the only place that we haven't been. Yeah. So, I'll revive... No, I won't. Do I have a dog biscuit? found something over here. What is it? Doggy? There's nothing. It's a psych out, maybe. I don't know. Oh. Wait, why did... Switch to your dog and walk around there. I am my dog. Okay. I'm dying as a dog. Oh, but I can just keep walking around. Cool. <laughs> he's dead, but he's still. That's funny it lets you do that. Haha, you can't kill me, I'm already dead. I guess it only counts if the boy is dead. Whoa, that was a double hit. I guess it probably always does a double hit. You have to wait to get an axe to get inside that cave. That makes so much sense. Because axes are used to chop stone. I know. <laughs> hmm, that time it only hit once. Am I just using my dog wrong or is he completely useless? I. Uh, he doesn't usually die that quickly that I remember. Maybe I haven't been upgrading his armor or something. What is that? A minotaur? Yeah, I think it is. He's got some defense, man. I think it's called Dancing Fool. That enemy. You can, it, when you have an alchemy alchemy spell and select enemies, it'll <laughs> tell you their name. Oh yeah.
So I could have come to this new this area even before the uh, last area if I wanted. Um, except you didn't have your dog to take you over to the uh, other side. That's right. Oh, nice. Oh, dang it, that's where I came from. I'm very observant. I almost wonder if the reason why they made almost every area in this game a maze is to pad the game out because they knew it was kind of short. Yeah, maybe. Because it's. Mazes aren't that fun, guys. Come on. I know, sometimes they're annoying. Yeah, like in Ark the Lad. Or there was one maze. There were a couple of Oh, Beyond mazes the Beyond. In... I keep saying yes. Ark the Lad, and I mean Beyond the Beyond. Yes, exactly. That was one I was thinking of. Okay. Okay, so I have to figure out where this. The path is. Oh. Are you okay? You took quite a spill out there. I think I'll be alright. We're getting used to flying and falling. Really? I'm trying to remember when we last flew and fell. Uh, when the pet rock died and we blew up. And from the prehistoric area, you blew up and you flew into this area. Who are you, friend? Where are you from? Well, I. You're definitely not from Crustacea. No. No facial hair, tattoos, or visible scars. And you're not from Nobilia, either. No toga or sandals. Actually, we're from... Wait, let me guess. You're from... Podunk. Wow, you're right. I'm Chocobit, and this is my dog, Beastie. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Horace Highwater. I, too, am from Podunk. I figured that it would just be a matter of time before another podunker arrived. You see, this ancient world is a product of my imagination. I knew it. I knew this is going to be the guy that dreamed up this world. Why is everybody's yeah. imagination so unoriginal? Like, it's. I know. It's like they're history buffs, and they wanted to imagine their favorite time in history. Yeah, I there's. Guess. Where's the? Where's the? Ch Willy Wonka chocolate factory world. I was the curator of the Natural History Museum in Podunk. My area of expertise was early civilizations and... You were part of an experiment in the big mansion on the hill and something went wrong. That's right. Terribly wrong. Okay. Of course he doesn't need to ask how did you know because why wouldn't he assume that's also how we got there? He's like, I'm sure you came here just by some normal bridge, but I was a victim of a terrible experiment gone wrong. Fire Eyes, er, Elizabeth, told us about it. She's the leader of the prehistoric world on the plateau. Yes, Elizabeth, Professor Ruffelberg's granddaughter. There was another guest at that party, too. Miss Blue Garden, the librarian. What a weird name. I've always suspected that we were the victims of foul play, but, who's, but by whose hand? I don't know but I think we can find out if we get these special diamonds. <laughs> I that just, makes sense, I doesn't heard it? The, yeah, I heard of these special diamonds in this world that I imagined. So obviously the diamonds are things of cre creations of my imagination. And I, for some reason, think that if we find these diamonds, then we'll know how we got to this world. An important guy in the city told me that they were very powerful. Didn't you create them with your mind? So the new leader is after the diamond eyes, is he? I thought he would be. They do represent a lot of power, and this fellow is hungry for power. He appeared on the scene only weeks ago and took over Nobilia very quickly indeed. He's very mysterious. None of my contacts has ever seen his face. I would suspect that he has nothing but bad intentions. What should we do? Chances are that the leader has other people looking for the diamonds too. I suspect, I suggest that you find the diamonds first and bring them to me when you have both of them. I'll make sure that they don't fall into the wrong hands. Okay, that that seems to portend that this is going to be the bad guy. I, I don't know if it will be, but it almost seems like a plot twist is coming when we give him the diamonds. The diamonds are in the Hall of Colossia to the north and the Great Pyramid to the south. Okay, so those are the other two bosses. We've dug yeah. pits that protect these sites from the harmful intruders. 
You can see hidden paths over these pits by using the revealer formula. My friend Madronius will give you this formula if you talk to him. Okay, we'll do it. Is this Madronius? He I appeared so. mysteriously when his name was said. It sounds like you've had a very interesting adventure indeed. I am Madronius, the alchemist. I've studied with Horus for many years. The new leader of Nobilia does not respect the treasures of our world. We have dug pits in front of the pyramid and hall in order to keep him and his men away. My revealer formula will allow you to see the paths across these pits. Get, you can get rid of Levitate. We're counting on you to save the treasures of our world. Would you like to purchase ingredients? Alright, good enough. I have everything, so it doesn't really matter which one it is. My brother is an alchemist as well. He has a hiding place in the hall of Colossia. Of Colossia. Check the walls. If you find him, he might help you. But he's kind of a jerk, so he may just let you die. I'm just kidding. He didn't say that last part. It's just funny that he said he might help you. Then again, he's never been very nice. Depends on his mood. So I like how they blocked off, by digging a pit, they blocked off the north and the south, and there's literally nothing else anywhere, so these people must lead a very boring life. Leave town, you can walk like 10 feet, and then there's a hole, or you can go north, there's a hole, or if you go east, you can go to that never-ending desert. Hello, kid. You look like you could use some rest. Well, I don't have any money. Oh, I do have that much. I guess you'll be the one that saves your game, too, hopefully. I hope you had a good rest. Would you like for me to record your progress? Game saved. Just imagine staying at the Marriott or the Hilton and they ask you if they can record your progress. <laughs> I got some brimstone. What, what else you got here, dog? Oh, you were just messing around. Just sniffing stuff that wasn't there. I can't go over here. Oh, this is blocked off. I wanted to go up there. Are there any ever are, are there ever any hidden like alchemy things that the dog doesn't ever that the dog doesn't find? Probably. Well, I thinks, wouldn't think it'd be too many of them, but there probably are some. Here, but I don't. Uh, this dog's crazy. Yeah, it's probably glitchy. I mean, it was SquareSoft's worst game. In the 90s, I don't know. I don't know at all. I don't think I've played all their games, but the worst game I played from them. Let's say that. Huh. All right. Wait. Hang on. I didn't check to see what was over here. <coughs> see, this dog is worthless. He's about to die already. I can't keep this guy alive forever. Look, he's took another hit, and now he's you poisoned. You can tell him. You can tell him to be non-aggressive, I guess, so he can stay alive and gain more levels. Maybe that's the only problem. Oh, I'm supposed to use the revealer thing. It wouldn't have taken me very many tries to find that anyway. <laughs> yeah. If you remember I if, if you memorize these paths you don't have to use it anymore. Dog's dead. At least he got a little XP. Well, lots of these magicians around.
Whoa. Ouch, plague. Double plague. Dang, plague was worse than poison. Dude, plague sucks. I'll bet it is double plague. That's why. These things probably plague too. I think those magician guys are the only ones who do it, if I remember right. Whoa, they're too fast. My spell can't catch it. Oh, there we go. Oh, I had poison and plague? I think it just called the plague poison. So the other one should wear off any second now. Dude. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, always be really careful when fighting the magician guys. I, when they, they only hit me one or two times out of like a million times. Like, I was pretty good, but. Yeah, when they start spinning their little wand around, just stay back. Well, here's a little bit of music in the game, the little there is. Yeah, I'll say this counts. Dude, I'm almost dead again. Stupid plague. I don't remember it lasting that long. Dang. Do I have an item that removes? Let's just use um, this because we never saw it do anything when we used it before. Dude, these things are hard to hit. Little slime balls. Oh, the pixie dust did what it was supposed to do. Oh, okay. So you don't use it on yourself. You just... I did you use have it, it on myself. Oh, you did use it on your... It didn't seem like it worked before. Uh-uh. Maybe it only has a certain chance of working? Uh, I don't know. Dealer again. Looks like... That looks like a switch on the other side of the pit. If I had something to throw, I could hit it. What? I don't wow, use revealer here. Why wouldn't I use revealer? Whatever. Maybe I do both. Yeah, you do. <laughs> well, that's convenient. I'm, I'm glad we missed those big spikes. That would have hurt. I'm getting wrecked up in here. I should be using defense. Okay, I have 44 heals. That's good. <coughs> Dude! <laughs> I don't think that I could possibly... Well, Beastie, I think our experiments with gravity have been a success. Okay, these... These aren't as witty as I think the people that wrote them thought they were. Maybe it would be yeah. better if it was delivered by a good comedian. Okay. So, I can't... I can't really, like, swing at them as I turn towards them. Because I'll always get a hit in before I can turn and, sw turn and swing. Two parts vinegar. Is that a door I hear? <laughs> I that is so sad. I'm sorry, sound effects guy. Your sound effects are so bad that um, nobody knew it was a door, so we had to tell them. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird. This guy doesn't start to cross until we reveal either, which would make sense, but. 
so I guess it's not weird, but it's surprising. Because it just shows an attention to detail that... Wait. Okay. I was like, I'm, I probably shouldn't be hitting her. That I didn't think that they put into this game. Greetings, young friend. Would you like for me to record your progress? Great, that's good. <laughs> so wait a minute, that one... How did she find her? I guess she had to reveal her too. Yeah. Or maybe she's stuck here forever. Um, so the guy that... The, the alchemist inside that last village said that his brother is an alchemist in the... Did he say it was in... Colosia? Colosia. Is this Colosia? Yeah. yeah. So I have to check through walls in this one to try to walk through walls, I guess. Yeah, I don't remember exactly where he is, but I, yeah, I just check every wall. Oh, that's just another exit, though. That wasn't walking through a wall. Let's just make sure none of these walls... Okay, that's um, falling in a hole. Well, you don't take any damage, though. That's nice. All right, I'm gonna revive the dog and put him on non-aggressive. So maybe, like you said, he'll gain levels. Well, do you think he'll gain levels if he doesn't actually kill anything? Yeah, he will. Oops, not act or not edit. I wanted to be on act. It's it's like most RPGs where even if you don't do the killing, you still get XP if you're alive. I may as well just have him never fighting because he's at this point he's never fighting anyway. Because he's always yeah. dead. Trying all these walls. And it's not very often you find armor for your dog. I mean, it's only ever a collar, but yeah, that's not gonna block much. You'd have to just be hitting the neck over and over to be able to block. <laughs> Maybe the dog's yeah. good at like blocking with his neck. trying every wall here, even the ones I can actually see what's on the other side anyway. Is this another maze? Is that what you were saying that... what you were saying this, about mazes before? This this one, this one, if it... You know, I don't consider it a maze, but if it is, it's not like that bad of one. There's a lot worse. Yeah. I didn't mean to come all the way over here. I was just checking walls. And then I ended up being somewhere. Oh, oh, okay. Hang on. I didn't, I didn't even explore this area, so I didn't realize that there was a wall right there. Okay. Surely walking through this wall would do nothing. I already can see what's on the other side and can walk there easily. I just don't even fight these things for the most part because they take. They're too hard to hit, and so they take forever to kill. Huh. They also don't have a low amount of HP, so that's like... Two reasons you... Oh, so easy to accidentally fall off the edge. Just... Try hitting that switch. Oh, it's a switch. Oh. Yeah, I, I didn't know it was a switch either when I first played this game. It doesn't stand out. The It looks like background scene, scenery stuff. Yeah, it doesn't look like what you'd normally think of as a switch oh, either. Oh, I didn't know I'd be stuck over here. Well, I guess I'm not if I fall well, if the you, hole. If, I think if you step on that floor plate, you would get it come back. I'm glad we found that secret passage in the pit. Now let's not go down there again. Uh, I couldn't walk past him. Okay, here's where I was. This thing's got some really high defense. Why does my non-aggressive dog seem to keep getting right in that guy's way? Now he's dead. What? I just picked up something and didn't say what it was. Hmm. 
got the fast jabs. What? Found 50 jewels. Oh, there's the message. I'm delayed. Oh, come on. I got stuck on the pillar. It's sucky. What? Where did that guy come from? Those green slime things kind of, kind of kind of reminds me of those green slimes on the Secret of Mana. Yeah. I'm trying to check this wall, but. And I think it might be one of those walls that's it's you know it's black and you just walk through a path you can't see until you find them. I think. Dude, things just keep appearing out of thin air, and it's really annoying. Okay. Jeez. The off-screen. Nectar. Oh, it disappears when you try to pick it up. That's lame. These things are a little easier to hit now that I've leveled up, I guess. Dude, that guy. He's feisty with those. Stop it. Whoa! Whoa, there's four of them! That's a door or something? I don't know. I mean, it made the sound effect that the game had to tell me was a door sound effect. Oh, okay. That was the part. Alright, did I check down here? In these walls? Yeah. So some of these, some of these switches are timed. So you hit the switch and you run to where the door uh, opens. Alright, I'll do that. I just remembered that. Of course, I don't know where the door is, but we'll just do a few trial runs to figure out where it is. This one's not a door, this is a bridge. Oh, okay. And the bridge was over here. Not there, up here. Go, go, go. There it is. Whatever. I don't think those mice have hit me yet, so. Oh, I didn't check for any. Ah. There you go.
I always hated these kinds of things. You can't see where you're going because there's no path, so you just have to guess. That's what I... What? Well, there's more than one. I wanted to find a guy. <laughs> that rat was real fast. Okay, dead end, I guess? Or is that what he wants me to think? Can those mice even hit me? Because I don't think I've been hit by one yet. Wait, 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 wait. This is the beginning again. Yeah. That's okay. There's, a, there's. If you go to the right, you, there's another side of the dungeon or whatever you call this. Over here? No, I couldn't go through any doors Oh, over there here. should be. Oh, okay. Maybe, oh, maybe it opens up later. Oh, there it is. There, there it is. Whoa. Oh, this is the door I opened. That's why I couldn't get there earlier. This is the second boss. That's called Minitar. <laughs> wow, two hits. Dang it. I couldn't even... <laughs> that was some BS. I'm gonna use Pixie Dust too, but I was gonna wait until I got in here. Dude. Oh, he's not on screen. Where'd he go? There he is. He's stuck. Oh, he's not gonna be stuck anymore. I just violently threw him across the room. Ow. or something. It's called free damage. And I think your pixie dust wore off, but no, maybe not. How can I you can't tell? tell. Well, it looked like it was a pink glow around you and it went away, but it looks like it's there now. I don't know. Why is my dog attacking when I told him to be very... Oh. He might not be docile anymore. I need to change his thing again. Act. Yeah, he's set to aggressive. Oops. Tried to open my menu. What's he doing? Oh, stomping. Oh, he's throwing a fit! <laughs> he seems to be pretty resistant to the... to the spell. Let's see if I can hit him with a regular attack. Oh, he got a soul ticked! He's just throwing a fit! Well, I guess he was made of explosives. He just combusted when I sh when I hit him with my sword. A plate appeared on the ground. I think you get the axe now. Oh, maybe not. Okay, a door opened, obviously, right? Because that sound of sounds like sand pouring against pouring down against some aluminum plate. That's the door opening. Thank you. 
checking checking for hidden walls or hidden rooms. Yeah, this qualifies as music. It's not like it's not a very um, com complicated song, but it's got enough components that I guess it counts. Can't go in there. Oh, okay, that's how you get in this one. Cast it 21 more times. I guess I won't use it right now. Wings! That sounds like it, a thing that I've never had. That um, ha helps you exit dungeons. Okay, I don't want to use that. Alright, so what I want to do is go in that room. So let's try one more combination of things here. Wasn't it? So maybe I'll try left middle instead of left right middle. Oh wow, the different colored slime. Okay, that bridge to your right will fall apart as you start to cross it, so look over here first to see if there's anything you need to get. Then you need to run across it though. Is that gonna you can be use nectar, nectar on the dog, maybe. I, I don't know if it'll be nectar or not. Hopefully. Dang it! It's okay. Next time we get nectar, I can pick it up. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Oh yeah, so this bridge to the right, you're just gonna have to run across it. What? Oh wow, they were stacked on top of each other. I think you are. Well, oh, okay. Put you over here. Dungeon. Not a dungeon, because they just let me right out. This is a cool little area. I like this level a lot better than any of the other levels so far. The Coloss Colossia, is that where I am? It's like. It's a lot less mazy. Not as much of a maze, but it's got like um, switches and like timed timed areas where the bridge is only up for a certain amount of time. You have to make your way there quickly. Oh, I see. You put me back here. Okay. Wait. Found another secret. Oh, there you go. Man, they don't make these easy to find. Because they, like, even once you've, like, figured out where it is, you have to, like, Navigate in the darkness. The invisible pathway, yeah. Honey? I did this for honey? So maybe I need to use speed to get through this, because I was running the entire time and I didn't make it. I remember this. I, I can't remember how you get across this either. I think you can do it if you run, but it's not easy, I remember. And I'm not sure if speed helps you dodge things or helps you run. I don't know. It's really weird. I remember this, but I don't remember how I got across. The trick here is to hold the run is to hold the run button, then keep tapping it when your attack meter runs out. Oh. Oh yeah. That's very, very strange that they put that in. <laughs> to me, it seems very weird. I did unless, not remember that at all. Unless the spam attack spam run button while your meter is out is like a technique that they intended to be in the game and that they want you to learn how to use. But it actually just feels like you're exploiting something that wasn't intentional. They're just like, oh, let's put it in here because it works this way unintentionally, but still does. 
Yeah, I hate that. Like, one of those things they never explained to you, but you're just supposed to figure it out. Okay, hit a switch. No. Okay. I meant to heal us both, but... I really don't think those rats have hit me yet. I don't think so either. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter what order you hit those in. There's no way I did that accidentally correct exactly the first time. I didn't check any hidden walls though. Beginning. Is it? I did flip a bunch of switches. Do you think there's any more doors on the right? There's there is one up here that I haven't been able to Yeah, this one's new. Oh, I know that guy was in there a second ago, because I just walked past that way. All of a sudden there's another one. Kicking my butt. What two? Uh, okay. No. Oh. He's dead. <laughs> That's one dead doggy. What does the honey do? I don't remember what that does. Is it an item or alchemy ingredient? It was, um, item. Dog, stop dying. You worthless dog. Switch. Oh, I didn't think I could walk over that. Killed my dog and now he's not gonna gain levels again. Door opened. Stop killing the dog. Dog, get out of there. Oh my gosh. You are the dumbest. He's already getting hit. Just got healed. I'm going to run out of uses of this spell. I guess if I don't have any more bosses in here, that's fine. I meant to get us both. Oh, oh, I gotta do a reveal. Psh. 
It's like if only we knew it was that easy. <laughs> if I could see the other side. Oh, dude. That guy got wrecked. Alright, any... Dude, I just killed you. You respawned. I just destroyed you. Okay. No false walls. I found a hidden thing again. Ooh, interesting. I wonder where this will go. Yeah, that's weird. It's what it would take you to two empty rooms. Well, there's still one more place. Brimstone and wax, and then... There's the dude! I found him! Nice. Hopefully he'll save the game, too. Is that you? I'm not Madronius, but I am his brother. How do you know him? He gave me lots of free alchemy ingredients. <laughs> Can trick his brother into giving it to us for free. He gave me the revealer formula so that I could cross big pits. <laughs> this dialogue looks like something I would have written when I was 12. And find the diamond eyes. It's a good idea to collect the diamond eyes now. I hear that there are others looking for them too. I can help you on your journey with this fireball formula. What? Why do I have so many dang things? Okay. I, I think it's better than flash, but you're going to have to get it leveled up, which could take a while, so it's up to you what you want to do. I mean, I want to use it, so I'm going to have to swap something else out. I don't ever use Crush or Atlas. <laughs> yeah, you know, I don't think you have limestone to use Crush. I heard Crush can be pretty decent if you level it up. I don't remember about fireball. I don't know, let's get rid of hardball. Yeah. Target gets beaned? I mean, come on, they're just begging for me to de-equip that. You'll need one part brim brimstone and two parts ash in order to use the formula. Would you like for me to record your progress? What the heck, dude? Your brother is hiding in the strangest location. He's literally... Um... You have to go through some in the wall tunnel for ever to get to where he is. I don't know how he eats or sleeps. There's no bed in there. Yeah, he's just stuck in there. Is there nothing over here? Wait. I have to kill these enemies. Yeah, try that. These things are tough. I don't care if the dog's confounded. <laughs> this guy like a mini boss. It might be a slightly stronger, yeah. Yeah, yeah he, a regular one would have been dead by now. But he doesn't even fight back. Okay, I'm gonna wallop him. I wonder if you get the axe from him. Dang, dude. He's got a lot of HP. He's infinitely... infinite HP. Yeah, oh, a spear. Oh, you got a spear, okay. I think I'm holding something up, but... It's hard to say. Yeah. Wait a minute, actually, look at the... the fire... through there. That's just a thing. <laughs> That's just a thing. There we go. Okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah. But I already had a spear. Oh, did my spear that I had, I couldn't throw this far or something? No, it wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have worked with the first one. For no reason. Oh, this is the boss. You can 
can tell by the music. Oh, okay. I guess the, I guess the other thing was a mini boss. The other two guys were mini bosses. Ow. One of them was. Oh, he's using crush on you. I don't even know where he is. Oh, there he is. Where did he go? Oh, he's just like. Oh. Whoa, that guy's weird looking. Okay, he's the big Minotaur thingy. He just did drain. Good fireball, fool. Uh, what? I can't tell how much it did because he keeps moving away. <laughs> he's a Megatar. The last one I killed was the Minotaur, right? Yeah, or 255. mini. 255. Dude, that's some damage. Found it. I'm having a really hard time not running into him. Oops. They did make it kind of hard to find that guy. It's a lot more powerful than Flash. I think when he's in a ball, he takes less damage, or... Yeah, when he's in the ball, he takes less damage. Whoa! I guess Flash is more powerful, actually. But it's level 6. Dang. Yeah, that's true. It is like 4 levels higher. Why has he got so much HP? This guy got like 10,000 HP or something? I don't remember how much he has. I want to say him. maybe 3,000? He had a lot of HP. Oh, and I just took some damage at the end. Good, didn't kill me. Oh, your dog came back to life. And I got the diamond eye. Why was the diamond eye... I guess the boss was guarding it, but I was just like, why would the boss be? Why would the boss have whatever? Doesn't matter. Well, you can you can come back to this area later when you have the axe to cut through those brick walls. Hmm. Okay, so oh, it doesn't even let me go. So is this like a? Would you get stuck here if you couldn't? Are you serious? It won't let you go over there. Oh, oh no, you have to start from the right. Maybe. Over here. I, I just fall off because I'll go straight to the village, I think. Yeah, it's faster. You should avoid falling into those pits. Are you okay? Yeah, I have full health, and I got here really fast, so it was way better. Yeah, I guess I should use that revealer form formula more effectively. <laughs> Dummy. 
I'd like to assist you in your endeavor to recover the diamond eyes, Choco Bit. In studying this ancient world, I have stumbled upon the ability to practice magic. If you need me, use a call bead, then call on me. I'll materialize and help you with my magic. You may uncover other spells that I can use in your travels. Oh. Great. Let's buy some stuff from this guy and then save it. Uh, 